Hi, Anaman here with an oracle, art oracle reading for you and for your children, your star children, if you have uh, any. And it also can be for yourself as uh, being a star child. A, uh, yeah, maybe you recognize yourself as a light worker or all these other terms you can give yourself. Chosen one. Um, well, empath, way shower, uh, you know them all maybe, or you are discovering it all. But this reading is for, um, well, let's say the star child in you. And I will start off with, um, with some cards and with some beautiful words on them. So uh, select one word that maybe uh, has a meaning for you or starts something in you, wakening up something in you. Um, and it goes along with uh, the artwork, my own artwork. I will select one for you to watch, to see as a card, to have a close-up. That will be your art, uh, art oracle card for uh, this reading. I have uh, one. Ah, it says touch. So, well, maybe you are touched by your child, touched in your heart. Also can mean you need a touch. Uh, some, how do you say, finesse, uh, some fine tuning with your child or you are in need of a massage <laughs> or your child is maybe you have to cuddle him or her more feel what resonate resonates in the, with this message so touch is the word for now for this reading and it uh, goes along with the with the artwork so i shall uh, select one for you well and to do that i'll will choose a, a number by rolling uh, this beautiful, uh, how do you say it in English, double stain dice, <laughs> well, two times, the first is a one, and we have a five, so it's six altogether. Yes, here we are, opening my art um, map <laughs> and pick this, this six uh, drawing because the number is six, three, oh, four, So here we are. I will make a close up for you. And this is your art oracle card for now. So here we are. And here it's with the card, with the word. For you and I will add a uh, some extra uh, words and well little pictures I'll select for you now so I will select some more items and oh this is my wonderful jar that opens up real <coughs> difficult maybe that's a sign do you have problems with your child <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> Who doesn't? Um, well, for now, let's select some uh, more signs. Oh, everything is a divination tool, isn't it? Well, what does it say? Oh my god. <clears throat> yeah, Corona extra. 
where did I put this one in my jar? Well, maybe it's a sign for you. Maybe you all had Corona at your home in your family. Maybe you or your child was very ill, still are maybe. Or this period of the Corona had some really um, deep impact on you all. Could be a sign. Um, it could have bring you all very close. Um, it also can mean for our ch star children, star families, that this was a very um, a awakened time, a time to feel activated um, as being a star, star child or star family to uh, to first see uh, some signs of it. <sighs> it can can be because Corona didn't mean for all of us um, that it was bad. And when you see through the veil, you know. So you, if you know, you know. Let's put this back. So. Well, it started getting uh, darker now. While I'm sitting here, I'll show you. Well, I'll pick for you a, another card. So, here we go. In my beautiful box with all kinds of little cards. I have to unwrap this one. What does it say? Mm -hmm. Oh wow. <laughs> golden. Yes. You are the golden one. You. Or your child. Or and or and or, I always say. Maybe there are more in your family. And, um, well, what do we have all together now? <laughs> I did put it back, didn't I? Yes, I did. Um, yeah, okay. <laughs> your oracle card, uh, your art oracle card uh, will be um, a complete picture with all these signs now. So I will create one for you. So here you go. All things put together and I now see that there is a bee in the picture yeah that can mean something to you a little busy bee well you can look it up what's the meaning of the bee symbolic meaning so you have uh, lots of divination tools right here <laughs> 